First, though, we do want to get you to this. President Obama heading to Wisconsin this morning. The purpose of his trip, though, could end up taking a backseat to the controversy over the building of a mosque in New York City. CBS News Chief White House Correspondent Chip Reed has the details. The president heads out this morning on a three-day cross-country trip. He'll be talking about the economy and raising money for fellow Democrats. The White House hopes this trip will help change the topic after a weekend of controversy over the president's comments about building a mosque near Ground Zero. The first family spent a quick weekend on the Gulf Coast of Florida, swimming, mini golfing and boating. The visit was intended to highlight the fact that on most of the Gulf Coast, the water is clean and the beaches are open. But the president's own comments over the weekend overshadowed the trip. Speaking at a White House dinner Friday celebrating Ramadan, the president waded into the already deepening political controversy over whether to build a mosque two blocks from the site of the 9-11 attacks in New York City. Let me be clear. As a citizen and as president, I believe that Muslims have the right to practice their religion as everyone else in this country. Saturday, the president seemed to back off from his initial comments, saying that while Muslims have the right to build the mosque, that doesn't mean they should. I was not commenting and I will not comment on the wisdom of making a decision uh, to put a mosque there. White House officials insist the president is not backing down from his original statement, but some Republicans say the White House is trying to have it both ways. The inference or the clear impression everyone came away with was that he was saying he was supporting the mosque at Ground Zero and he can pass it later on and sort of back away. But the fact is that is clearly the impression I believe he wanted to leave. The White House says the president has no regrets about his comments, even though they turned a local issue into a national debate. Traveling with the president, Chip Reed, CBS News, Joint Base Andrews, Maryland.